Afternoon everyone, Marty the Mad Magpie here. Just come on this afternoon to share my thoughts on Anthony Gordon's decision to play for Scotland. Now it's not been finalised yet, but Anthony Gordon is keen on joining up with the Scotland squad and basically trying to get his place in the national team because he's not getting a lot of uh, scope with England, is he? Uh, but thank you for joining me this afternoon. And uh, if you want to get instant access to me videos, just subscribe to my channel. It's completely free. Any new videos that flash up, you will get instant access to as soon as they are uploaded. So Anthony Gordon is apparently deciding that he wants to play for Scotland uh, to further his chances of getting into the national team. And my personal opinion on this is um, is good on the lad. I mean, Elliot Anderson is uh, also looking at the Scotland squad as well. And, you know, there are some critics out there who are saying, well, he's English, why should he go and play for Scotland? But look at the players down the years, you know, that have, have looked at different nations, you know, simply and purely because they can't get into the into the England team. I mean, getting into the England team, you know, is very, very difficult, particularly with a the manager they've got at the minute. You know, um, you can be playing out your skin with uh, with your club absolutely being outstanding, and um, you're not you're not going to get picked by Gareth Southgate because he's got his favourites, and um, you're just wasting your time. So if you have any relatives um, of you know England. Uh, Scotland, Northern Ireland, Republic of Ireland, Wales, you know, or even foreign nations, you know, you, you're going to try and jump ship, aren't you? Because you, you want an international career, and that's fair enough. Now, Anthony Gordon, you know, really did shine for the under-21s, didn't he? And, um, you know, he was magnificent for them, in fact. And the way I look at it is, if he wants to go into Scot the Scottish team, and he wants to try for that... And he has got Scotland, Scottish heritage, and good on him. But there are some critics out there who are saying that he's doing it just because he wants to get into the uh, into the Euro setup, and he wants to play international football. For Scotland. Well, you doesn't do that. I mean, in my my opinion, you look at some of the greatest players of all time. I mean, look at like let's just take um, let's just take Ryan Giggs for example. Now, Ryan Giggs. Um, he ended up playing for Wales, right? But as a youngster, he played for the English England schoolboys, England under-18s, whatever. But he decided to go to Wales. Why? Because he stood more of a chance playing for Wales than he did playing for England. Ian Rush, a scouser. Look at Ian Rush, joined up with Wales. Look at him. Absolutely fantastic player. Could he have got into the England team, Ian Rush? Probably. But... He chose Wales. Gary Speed, Yorkshireman, chose Wales. Why? Because he gets his place. You know, look at Mick McCarthy. You're going back even further back. Mick McCarthy, Republic of Ireland. Chris Hutton, the Republic of Ireland. Both English players played in the English game, but they couldn't get into the England team. So... The way I see it is, Anthony Gordon wants to go and do this. He wants to join up with Scotland to get an international career going. I say, good on you, son. I, I go for it. Because if, if it was me, my if I was a professional footballer, and I had Scottish heritage, um, it might have made me going back years. But if I couldn't get into the England set up, and Scotland were offering us a place, or the Republic of Ireland or Northern Ireland were offering us a place, I'd be like, yeah, go for it. Absolutely. So I just I just look at it as a good thing for Anthony Gordon. And what I say to him, the best of luck, whoever he plays for. But hey, if he gets into the Scotland team, that's magnificent. Because Gareth Southgate isn't going to pick him. Because as I said before, Southgate's got his favourites. And he's not going to change his ways. And Anthony Gordon, he might be waiting a while to get into the England setup because, you know, we might win the tournament next year. Euro twenty twenty four. We might not, but you never know with Southgate, we might get it right this time and we might be lumbered with them for a few more years. But in my opinion, Anthony Gordon is making the right decision to join up with Scotland if that's what he wants to do.
Okay? So I'm going to keep it short, guys. Thank you so much for joining me. Marty the Mad Magpie. Catch up with you all soon. Thank you for watching. All the best to you. Bye-bye for now. Thank you.